Like spacing for... Yeah. That's right. So I got this center line right here. Runs down a large stretch of the house and then as you can see here there's one, two, several doorways and openings that are centered off that. So we snapped it out on the floor, transferring that up. And then uh, I've got a 3-0 door here and we're adding an extra two inches for the rough opening. I'm just transferring up my wall partitions. <laughs> That's right, it's very handy, handy. I like to put a U or a D on my, my layout to show which way your L's going for backing for the walls. So 6D, I've got a D facing downward, we'll back that wall. And this wall, pretty much the whole stretch is a sheer wall. Which means it'll be sheeted in any of the joints in the plywood, you gotta have a, a double stud there full backing. Do jack studs for the doorway. I also like to indicate on my top plates where the double top plates are going. So here, my double top plate's gonna shoot past five and a half inches once that wall's up. It's gonna tie to the exterior wall up there. And that's pretty much how you lay out a wall. Yeah, and that's that.